Hello beautiful people of YouTube, it's Daniel Rodriguez here, time to review Z Nation Season 2, Episode 14, titled Day 1. One more episode before the season finale. Thanks for uh, joining me, man. See the previous episodes for Season 2, man, all spoiler reviews. Again, Season 2, Episode 14, Day 1. One of the most dramatic episodes out of the season, man. It brings you to the backstory of the characters, Doc, 10K, Addy. Uh, Warren, man. It's just a very emotional, driven episode, man. Uh, so here we go. Just take less than two minutes to recap the episode, give you the pros, give you the cons. And I really, uh, you know, appreciate it for checking out the channel, check out the other reviews as well. I review many more shows uh, besides Z Nation, man. I mean, I review uh, some shows you see here, man. I review stuff like, um, well, The Flash, Arrow, Legends of Tomorrow, The Walking Dead, uh, I mean, American Horror Story Hotel. Uh, the Librarians, Agent Carter's coming up, Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D., very, very different, different shows. The X-Files is coming up, make sure to check that out on the channel as well. And also Lucifer, make sure to check it out. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Citizen Z was going to go to jail, man. This was a flashback. He was going to go to jail. He was a master hacker, but he's recruited by the government. Uh, and, of course, we're in the present day now, and he's hacked at his base. Who can hack me, man? So he's walking... And, uh, you know, he's walking around, you know, searching stuff. Warren is at the base. This is a flashback of Warren's back. And so Citizen Z was going to go to jail and everything because he's a master hacker and everything. Present day, he's was hacked at the, the base. Now, we go back to Warren's uh, past, and she's at the base. She's, a, like, a general or something, a lieutenant. And uh, then that's what we just see her at the base and everything. There was a throwdown going there. And, and you know, her some of her... Uh, workers, some of the other marines or army uh, men, turn into zombies. That's when the outbreak happened. She had to kill them. Now, uh, in present day, they're walking where Disneyland is supposed to be. That's a scary sight, man. So, Doc was a therapist. Uh, oh, man. Well, hey, um, you're not going to school today, are you? Hey, no, you don't need to go to school today. What? Where are we going? Why do we have to be in the car? Well, we're going to Disneyland. What? Going to Disneyland. And then, then they start crying. I, I know those videos. We're going to Disneyland. Mom, are you for real when? Today. We're going today. How long? Seven days. Hey. You know, you know those videos. And then that one girl that was like looking like that. What the fuck? Like that? You know that look? Oh my god. Funny ass video. I just look it up like kids going to Disneyland. Reaction when parents ask and like, oh god, this is so cute, man. It makes me cry all the time. It honestly does. I'm like, why did my mom do that? Why, do, why did I get that love, man? So anyway, Doc it was a therapist, Oxy and all that. He's freaking out, man. The zombie apocalypse is going on. Addie is at a hawking game, and guess who she meets? The love of her life, Mac. Mac is a hockey player, man. It took me a while to realize that was Mac. And then they were together. I was like, god damn it, Mac. I didn't like your character much, but now that you're back, I kind of like you. I want you to come back, man. Where, where the hell's Mac, man? He's such a good character. So anyway, there's a fight. You know, they fight together and everything. Hey, we should stick together. So 10K is fishing, and he's attacked. He's knocked out. His dad saves him. Uh, so that's 10K's background. Vasquez, he's at a funeral, his family funeral. He's attacked. Even by his own family, he sees his wife and daughter rise. Like, rah, like all that. Uh, so anyway, Murphy is in prison. We see Murphy. No beard, no nothing. He has his hair come back, and he's just sort of like in jail. He's in prison. Hey, want to play for some cigarettes? You know, you know. And uh, the zombie apocalypse goes down, man. There's a breakout. He locks the people inside. He is scared. Gotta find dinner, man. So, find dinner. They go inside. Oh, find, excuse me. They find this diner. They go inside, and there's an old lady with a weapon inside. Of course, Murphy and them are on the outside, but they're in California already. They go inside this thing where it says the base is supposed to be, and this old lady's inside, and, you know, Vasquez and Warren are inside. 
What did I think about the episode overall, guys? Let me tell you, first off, the flashbacks are what's really important about this episode, man. Definitely, for sure, the flashbacks give a sense of uh, emotion in here, a sense of more backstory to the characters to flesh them out. Vasquez's backstory was really, really emotional indeed, man. Uh, how he was the only one at the funeral, and he saw his own wife and daughter, and sadly, most likely had to kill them. That was something, man. The opening of the episode as well with Citizen Z and you see and like it was like present day, you know, we don't get to see much of like regular Z Nation, like in sit like day, like Z Nation back when the world was the world. Uh, Murphy as well, man, I will say seeing Murphy's backstory was awesome. Mac is back only for a snack. Mac is back only for a snack. Ate a tic tac. Eat your ass in a flash. I don't know. Either way, that happens, man. Hell, their perspectives are interesting. It's a very interesting episode. The action as well, the practical effects and the action and the zombies, the look that they have were very nice. And Citizen Z, I mean, come on. Citizen Z was a hacker. He's a master hacker. He even hacked the person that hacked him back. Oh, come on. It's too easy. Give me a challenge. Okay, now. Okay. Okay, mister. Don't you, uh, don't you, oh, you get too cocky now, all right? Oh, uh, the only cons, man. Doc being a therapist. I bought that, man. I, I, I used to be a therapist, 10K. You know, kid, it wasn't that bad. I just swallowed the, I just swallowed the smoke. <laughs> I'm not saying, I'm not taking points off, but I'm like, really, Doc being a therapist? Yeah, man. Oh, you like Judy down the hall. He, she's really cool. <laughs> I don't know. It's a little, anyway, 10K was the least interesting, though. 10K was like fishing. I'm a 22-year-old boy in 10-year-old clothes. I have fish. Dad? Uh, uh ma'am. You look like a person that I was, I was a zombie video with. Uh, why are you attacking me? Dad, I've been laying here for two hours and nobody's attacked me or eaten me. Ah, I'm off, son. I found you. Pfft, like, really? At least interesting. And the ending of the episode, man, where it's kind of like they're in the diner. It's almost like a really, that's where you're going to end the episode in the diner and the woman has a weapon. And then you show next week's promo and you show that they make it out of it. Okay. Overall, I'm going to end up giving the episode a B plus, guys. Like I said, it's a very emotional ride. Uh, uh, it was a really, really good episode. Uh, I really enjoyed it thor 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 thoroughly, uh, thoroughly, man. It was a really interesting episode for sure. Definitely check it out if I just spoiled it for you guys. A very emotional. And uh, get on the hype train, man. Z Nation Season 2 and then Season 3 premieres later this um, this fall. Comment down below. Let me know what's your favorite part of Z Nation. If you really like the channel, you like the review, make sure to hit that subscribe button. And I'll see you guys later. Save the Murphy, save the world.